Hello there guys, Proxens here, and welcome back to another episode of the Windcraft server. So, welcome back everyone. So, uh, last episode we were stuck in a, just a bad quest, and it, it, just, it sucks. And we're still stuck in it, because we gotta finish it. A confused far over. We have to go over to a jail. So, Remix actually gave me a horse. A nice brown horse. So, thank you, wherever you went now. So now we have to go all the way over to Drail again. So, uh, let's actually find the coordinates really quick. And let's go over there. So, press F3. And he's located at 305. Oh, his X is 305, so we're actually not that far away. Oh, we're going to Drill now. So, Drill's the guy over here. Okay. So, let's head over to him. Gosh. I hate the I hate the quest in all honesty. I'm going to put that out there. There we go. I uh, Drill's this guy. The other guy is whatever his name. Wait, you, you just walked up to him and told him I wasn't a cow? It was that easy. I assumed a person who was crazy enough to mistake a person for a cow wouldn't listen to reasoning. So I just spent three years of my life in prison for nothing unless, of course, he sent me something as an apology. Really? Not even a few emeralds? You'd think he'd feel guilty enough to at least give me something in return for the three years of my life he wasted. Oh well, I guess I'll just be optimistic. Got him. Uh, quest completed. Yes. Good. That is wonderful. Okay, can we get the horse out again? There we go. Let's get going. Ah, go back into Deltus. Or Deltless. Or whatever. I always mess up the name anyway. Okay, so right clicking this, let's figure out what quest we can do. Um, speak with Bulbo. I would love to speak with Bulbo, but first I'm actually going to gain some levels here. I want to get to level 20 before we actually get going on more quests because level 20 is like a good level to be at from what I hear because you, 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 you get access to a lot of quests basically. You, you get the access to the quests. So there's an emerald imp. Get him. Get him. Got him. Got him. Woo. So we, we got a bunch of emeralds. Basically, that's what the emerald imp was. He just drops a bunch of emeralds. So over here is actually the place we're going to train. I believe this leads us to the ancient Nemkrat. Or Nemcat Village, which is where I want to be because we can get some nice level 17s, which is exactly the level we are at, which should give us like 40 experience, so that's good. Okay, stop flying. He's flying. He's hacking. The zombie's hacking, guys. If I lose to the zombie, it's because it hacked. Zombie hacks confirmed. Ah, oh, man. Let's just kill a few of these guys to get that experience. Yeah, again, I want to get to level 20 because it offers us a huge advantage in everything, basically. We're also going to head back over to the dungeon. Because I do... Like, the dungeon being the first dungeon. It just the dungeon. We'll head back over to it. I won't specify what dungeon it is. We'll just go to the dungeon. What, what level do we... Actually, I'll figure it out once we get to level 18. I need to find out what level I need to be to get my next spell. Okay, be careful. Be careful. There we go. Gotta cover all angles. Because the skeletons here are level 19. Ooh, we got a dagger. Don't really... I don't really uh, have the ability to use the dagger, but hey. That's cool and all. So there's a chest up here. It's got a bunch of emeralds. Uh, I'll take that, I guess. You know, you find some unidentified armor, you're going to identify it and see if it's good. That's how it works. Most of the time. 
Unless you just you have a feeling that it's bad. And sometimes that happens. Because some armor in this game is genuinely bad. So let's get out of here. Let's go over to the Nemcrat, at least closer to it. I don't want to go like straight up into it because it's not the best of ideas. I'm just gonna put that out there. It's not really the best of ideas. So let's see. Ooh, uh, one sec. We have a skeleton key. Sorry, I was just making sure we can actually go back back to the dungeon once we get the chance. So let's kill these skeletons. Zombie hiding in the bushes. Drops a dagger. Can we fight more zombies hiding in the bushes? Granite hone shears. Yo, I want to use this as my weapon. No, I don't want to use a bow. I want to use this. Hey, fight me. Fight me, dude. Oh my gosh, I can't. I mean, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. It was a joke. It was just just a joke, man. Just a joke. Don't worry. Don't 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 actually like destroy me with your sword. Okay. I mean, I don't uh, I don't need help right now. Ah, uh, Remix is always like just there to help, you know. He gave me the horse. Hey, we got a level. So we need to get level 21 to actually go to uh, the bomb spell. Okay. I'm just like circling these guys. That is probably a terrible idea now that I think about it because it gives them more opportunity as a whole group to just decide to target me and hit me once and then just destroy everything. Just, just everything, you know, just gone. So, there's probably going to be some zombies hiding in the bushes. Ironically, that's actually their name. I don't know if that's ironic, though. You know, it's okay. It's okay. Forget that I said that. It's not ironic at all. I think. <gasps> we got a diorite hone stick. I thought a stick would be an archer weapon. I mean, if an archer grabs a stick, I think it can hit stuff with it. Wow. Not even cool. A skeleton who gets triple shot. Oh, uh, 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 there we go. Oh my gosh. There's zombie hiding in the bush. Zombie hiding in the bush. Is. Need to make sure to add the is because it's plural. Because there's more than one bush. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, 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 get him. Okay. That is one fast skeleton. Ah, oh, die. What about this armor? I mean, it's nice, actually. Uh, once we get to level 19, I'll head over to Deltus again. De de lost, de Deltus, Deltus, there we go. There, That's the right name. So let's actually go a little bit closer to the Nemcrat. Like, I'm really risking this here because, again, the Nemcrat is a very, very risky place. It's full of uh, powerful mobs and even more powerful mobs. And I, wanted, I need a good bow. I need a better bow in all honesty. Okay, let's just shoot this and then do this. I, I want these guys to, like, drop a good bow. Which is kind of why I'm going to the Nemcrack, because I know there's some mobs over there that do use a bow. Some bowing skeletons, you know. They use the bow. Okay. I've got them in my sight. They do a ton of damage, which is perfectly fine, because... Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Ah! Ah! I should have got some potions of healing... Okay, got him. I'm afraid to go in closer. He's not aggroed on me. But I probably just did aggro him on me. So that's always great, you know? Whoa, 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 buddy, 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 watch it. Ooh, you dropped a bow. A granite owned bow. Yeah, it's a... Wait a minute. Oh, very slow. 
I mean, it does 68 damage, though. I'll keep that on me. I have to identify these two bows. I'll do that later. Once we actually go back to the city. You know, I like the melee ones more because, A, we can get more experience from them. Not literally, though, but, you know... I mean, if we fought all these, like, shooting ones, we could probably get a ton more experience, but... We can get more experience from them because they are me melee and we don't have to worry about them shooting at us. It's actually going closer here. Okay. I think this is like a melee field over here. Which we can grind experience from. Okay, watch it buddy, watch it buddy, watch it, watch it. I might not be able to shoot fast, but I'll still be able to kill you eventually. Okay, got him. Got him in my sights. Okay. That's a lot of them. Oh, whoa, whoa. Buddy, 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 buddy. What? I, I keep calling them buddy because it's just like, you know, please don't kill me. I got another one. Another one. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh, uh, get back. We got, got him. Yay. I killed it. Being it being the skeleton. Alrighty, in that case, what the heck was that? Okay. We're very close to the actual, like, center of the Nemcrat. Okay, going in! Going in! Ah, I died. I died. I died. I died. I died. I died. <laughs> I mean, I was expecting it in all honesty, but hey! Perfectly fine, perfectly fine. Item identifier. Identify my bows. And... My pants. Crossbow, crossbow, crossbow. <gasps> A silver bow! And which one's actually better? Because we need 29 for that. Ooh, regal chaps. Those are probably better than whatever pants I have on now. Level 23 plus. How do you expect me to get to level 23? Actually, it's pretty easy. So what's this one? Silver bow. 22 to 40. Oh, we need to... See, again, everything is level that... Uh, okay. Almuj. I don't know, but I'm kind of willing to risk it because it says level 12. Slash 30. Oh, wait, this is the one with the, the mushroom. The mushrooms that I never liked. So, because of that, I'm actually going to stand straight out here in the open, give them enough distance to actually see me, and then I'm just going to shoot them until we get enough, like, you know, it's, uh, mana to run. Because you need a lot of mana to <gasps> Wait, I remember. I remember what I want to do. There we go. How much experience did we get from her? I need to like check that the next time she spawns. 55! Hey! Good source of experience. 94! 44! Just gotta keep killing her, you know? There we go, 75! This is, this is like, free XP, basically. I feel like this is a glitch that's like, not, not even a glitch, sorry. This is like a easy way that a bunch of people should know about. Just, hey, you, you want a bunch of experience. What the heck did I just drop? That is most definitely not a dagger.
what the heck is that? No! Go back in. There we go. No, no, no. Whatever that is, I kind of want to identify it now. Here, how about we just use a quick teleportation scroll? There are aggressive mods and mobs nearby. Yeah, y you don't say, do you? Okay, so uh, the only way we're gonna get out of here without getting just no, 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 no. Go, go, go! Mushrooms are attacking. Ah! Go! They're coming in. They're following me. That one mushroom is just gonna come into the center here and just demolish me. Oh gosh, this is a cool item. How does this look? Yo! I don't know why I wasted money on that, but that's pretty cool. I guess I did it because it looked cool. I guess there was really no other reason to that, you know? So, let's go back inside the witch's hut and continue demolishing to the... the just the level. Getting all the levels. Basically, shoot her with the bow until we get to level 20. Ah, <laughs> oh, man... Great, just spectacular. 59. Just stand here. She'll never respawn right on top of us. And we'll always be able to continue shooting at her. Until she gives us experience. And then do it again. And again. And again. And again. And that's not better than what I've got on. I kind of want to get these, like, just just have the ability to get them. 74! Just keep killing the witch, and then we'll eventually become rich with levels and experience, because that's what happens in Windcraft. You know, that just... just it's how Windcraft works. You, you go into the witch's hut and you just kill the witch. And eventually you'll become the very best at Windcraft. Just, just trust me. Trust me. It's Windcraft logic. I feel like in two more kills we'll be able to, like, get just enough experience. One more kill and then we're good. Where does she spawn? Why aren't you spawning? There you go. Hey, level 19 has been acquired, everybody. It's just great, you know? It's just great how you, you go into the witch's hut and you just keep killing her. And you, you know, you'll get eventually to level 20. Eventually, you'll get it. So, let's just keep doing this here until we're like halfway there. Of course, in the next episode, we're going to have to grind up a little bit as well after we start the quest, because... Oh, wait, no, you know what quest we can actually do? The one in, a uh, uh, I forgot what it's called, but it's that place with the well that we couldn't get down, but we actually did get down it. And I, st I still have a bat here, in there. There we go. Come on. That's a lot of cows. I'ma just head inside and continue shooting the witch until we get enough uh, experience. So, you're, you're taking my experience, man. You're sharing experience. I 
I, I, every other people know the secret now. It's not the same. It'll never be the same. There we go. 30, 39, that's just bad now. <laughs> it used to be like 90 and stuff, but now it's going to 39 because there's another person here. Hey, we're good now because we're getting it all. There we go. Gosh, like, look how fast we're advancing. Imagine comparing this to just, like, normal grinding with some other mob somewhere else. That one was a bad, just, just, a, just a bad. It was a bad amount of experience. Come on. Come on. Just give me more experience, please. 46. It'll never be enough to get up to the level that I want to. Which is 20. And eventually we'll get there. Just takes time and just precise shooting of the witch in the witch's hut. That is right here. And I just wasted some mana. You know, let's do a, a nice bow spam there. Gosh. Imagine if you could bow spam like that in normal Minecraft. So many people would get mad. Gosh, that, that'd be so annoying. You just get bow spammed and bow spammed and bow spammed and bow spammed and then bow spammed and oh man, the more I imagine it, the worse it see the the worse it seems. So I'll just stand here. It's gonna keep respawning and then you know we'll just keep killing it. There we go, sixty four. We'll get halfway to twenty. Should be enough for now. But I'll start taking this out. So I do hope you all enjoy this episode of Windcraft. You know, just we're just grinding up levels, experience by killing the witch who previously asked us for stuff. I think, or I think it was just like the guy outside, the assistant who asked us for help for the witch. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching, and well, as always, I'll see you all in the next episode of Windcraft. So, bye bye everybody.